Hi there, my name is Katherine Kelly in case you haven't seen any of my videos before. Today I'm here to do a video all about the perfect summer lip products. If you like this video, I would really love it if you subscribed or gave the video a thumbs up, but let's just jump in to the lip products. So for lip products in summer, I generally tend to do a more like subtle daytime lip most of the time. So a gloss or a more like sheared out liquid lipstick, nothing super like matte or like dry down in the daytime at least. Okay, because my lips can get super dry in the summer too. One product that I really recommend is this Revlon Kiss Exfoliating Balm. So basically what this is, is one of those exfoliating scrubs, but in more of like a stick form. I like that because it makes it really, really easy to use. And since it has the little bit of a balm texture in there, it also gives your lips a little bit of hydration. And as you can see, it's more of just like a balm and then it has little like gritty bits in there. So I would definitely recommend this as like a pre-makeup step. Uh, anytime you're doing your makeup in the summer. Okay, so as I mentioned, I really like to do a more glossy look in the summer. So whether I wear a lipstick underneath or not, I'm generally wearing these two lip glosses a lot of the time. So the first one is the Buxom White Russian Lip Polish. Uh, so this is a lip plumper and it gives a really nice shine to the lips. I will go ahead and swatch it for you. And as you can see, it's just a really nice like pink, light pink nudie gloss. So I find that this is really great to pretty much go on top of anything, especially if the product leans a little bit pink. One thing I super commonly do is put lip liner on my lips and then just wear a gloss over it. And I find that to be really comfortable, but also give you a little bit of color. Okay, the next gloss I've been loving recently is the Essence Shine 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 Wet Look Lip Gloss. And this one is in the shade Smile, sparkle, shine. And this is like $3 at the drugstore and I love it. So as you can see, it's a little bit more pink than the Buxom one, uh, but this gives you more of like a lip topper effect. I am wearing it today over something else, but yeah, as you can see, this just has a lot more reflection than the Buxom. So I really like this if I'm wearing something that I would like a more like lip topper prismatic effect. So if I'm wearing more dramatic makeup and I want to go for a gloss, sometimes this is what I do. Okay, one thing I've really been liking doing this summer is shearing out a liquid lipstick on my lips. So basically I'll do like three dots on my top lip and three dots on my bottom lip and then take a fluffier makeup brush and just blend it out so it gives you a little bit of that color payoff but it's not super matte and drying and it gives you more of like a lip stain effect rather than a liquid lipstick and my favorite liquid lipstick to be doing that with this summer so far is the NYX liquid suede metallic in the shade Bella so this is a swatch of it like full pigment but I'm gonna go ahead and blend it out for you and show you what it looks like I normally use a brush like this it's more of like a concealer brush and if I go ahead and blend it out that's what it looks like so as you can see it's a lot more subtle and not as dark or anything like that and you also still get the sparkle from the metallic of this liquid lipstick so I've really been liking doing that and then I'll either just wear it like that or I love to put that essence gloss over this one or I'll also just put a clear lip balm on on top of it and I've really been liking that as well. Okay, so if I'm in the mood to wear a lipstick in the daytime in the summer, I normally try to go for something that's not super, super matte. So I've been loving this uh, Rimmel Moisture Renew lipstick. This is in the shade 220 Dusty Rose. It's just like the name says, it does feel really moisturizing on the lips. It goes on really smoothly. It doesn't tug at anything. And the color is just a nice like everyday nude, so I've really been enjoying wearing that. On that same sort of trend of not wanting to wear something super matte and drying, I have been loving this Tardis Creamy Lip Paint. This is in the shade FOMO. And these are great because, again, they don't dry down and they don't make your lips feel too, too dry. So I love wearing this one with uh, the Buxom Gloss over it, actually. And it is just like a little bit of a brighter take on a nude. So that's why I've been loving this one for summer as well. In the summer, I will wear a matte lipstick or a matte liquid lipstick. 
if I'm wearing it out in the night or something like that, or if the matte formula of the lipstick is a more creamy formula. One new lipstick that I've really been loving this summer so far is the Morphe Mega Matte Lipstick in this shade Tease. To me, this is just the most ideal summer shade that you can think of. It's this really nice like orangey red. To me, it leans a little bit more orange and it's really bright and that's the kind of color that summer kind of reminds me of this like bright orangey red. To me, it's the perfect summer red. And I find the formula on this to be pretty comfortable. Okay, similar to that, I have the Milani Matte Glam Lipstick. And this is the same sort of thing. So I actually find these two formulas to be pretty similar. Uh, this, again, it goes on really creamy, so you can kind of rub your lips together after you apply it. And I love this kind of bright purple shade for the nighttime in the summer. Now, two shades that I love to wear out in the summer when I'm looking for something to stay on my lips for a long time, but also make a little bit of a statement, are, is first the NYX Liquid Suede in the shade Run the World. So this is pretty similar to that Milani shade that we just swatched. It's a little tiny bit brighter, but this makes your teeth look really white. And if you're wearing like an all white outfit or even like all black, this kind of gives you that like summer pop of color, which I really, really like. And then last but not least, I also really love the NYX Liquid Suede in the shade Jet Set for if I'm going out. This I kind of only wear in the nighttime, but if I'm going out in the night to a party or something, it's dark enough that people kind of think you're wearing like a purple, but it also has that brightness that is really unique and fun for the summertime. I actually wore this Jet Set color with the Essence Gloss over it the other day and thought it was absolutely stunning with the reflection of the essence glitter in the gloss. Okay, so those are my top picks for summer lip products. Like I said, on a general day-to-day -day basis, I kind of just stick to a lip balm. But if you're looking for something a little bit more fun and exciting, I would recommend all of these products. I think they're all really great. I've also done this video for winter lip products as well as spring lip products. So I'll have those linked down below in case you'd like to check them out. If you have some lip products that you've been loving for the summer, I would love it if you left them down below. I'd love to check them out. And if you like this video, I would really love it if you subscribe to my channel. I put out new videos every single Wednesday. I want to thank you again for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.